What's up everyone, it's the Epicurie here. In this video, I'll be giving my thoughts on one of the new 3x3s, the Volk 3. This puzzle was created by Chi and approved by Matt's Volk. It is now his main speed cube and was used to set the European record for the fastest single solve of 5.13 seconds. The cost of the Volk 3 is $19.95 on speedcubeshop.com. The price may increase or decrease depending on where you purchase the puzzle. There is also a starter kit available on Speedcube Shop, which comes with a sticker remover, half bright stickers, weight 3 silicone lubricant, and a mini screwdriver from Moyu. All this for only $4 extra, a total of $23.95. I decided to get the starter kit with my order. The Chi Volk is 55.5mm, which is smaller than most other 3x3s. The size doesn't feel uncomfortable in my hands, despite them being quite large. If you're a person with small hands, this puzzle could be a big improvement. The Volk comes in three different plastic colors, black, white, and stickerless. The shades on the stickerless are bright with good contrast, nothing really different from most other puzzles. Although the shades seem to be good, I do occasionally have a hard time finding the right pieces in a solve. It could just be me, but it doesn't seem to happen on other cubes. Out of the box, this 3x3 wasn't overly impressive. Corner cutting was good, but it took some reasonable force. The factory lube made it feel gummy, but the core didn't have enough lube in it, so it had some spring noise. After breaking in and setting up the Volk 3, the performance greatly improved. It has a slightly bumpy and scratchy feel, similar to the Guo Guan Yu Xiao, and blocky feeling that is reminiscent of an old Diane product. It does feel different from most other Chi Yi puzzles, however, it does have a slight hint of a heavily lubed thunderclap somewhere in its performance. It's light, crisp, and slightly sandy. Corner cutting is past 45 with some force, and reverse is somewhere over 1 QB. In my opinion, this is one of the puzzles that can be set up to be whatever you'd like it to be. With a heavy lube, this puzzle can be smooth and controllable, but with a lighter weight, it can be fast and snappy. Today, most puzzles have the same mechanism, and to some extent, this puzzle doesn't vary from all the others. It has squared off corners to prevent corner twisting. The edges and corners have small veins similar to the original GAN 356. The Volk has a double or triple torpedo design to prevent popping. The core is stable with a plastic center and long metal screws that are easy to tension and lube. The only downsides that I can think of for the Volk 3 is that it's more expensive than most 3x3s, and it might be a little too fast for some solvers, unfortunately including me. In conclusion, the Volk 3 is a good puzzle has many upsides and few downsides. If you're looking for a new 3x3, the Volk 3 would be a good choice. If you decide to pick it up, I'll leave a link in the top of the description. Don't forget to use the discount code, the Epicuber 10, for 10% off. Sadly, we have come to the end of this video. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like. And if you like more content, please subscribe. I'm the Epicuber, and you have an epic day. Bye!